If congressional candidates in some states win, they might have Edward Snowden's coattails to thank. I'm Matt Rosendale, and this is how I'd look from a government drone. And this is what I think about it. Matt Rosendale is a state lawmaker in Montana, running against the burdens that he says Washington places on one too many people. States should be allowed to function uh, independently as our founders had intended. Right now, the federal government has inserted itself through the EPA, the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service. The federal government is too big and too powerful. It's appealing because he's, he's one man saying, we are not, in this country, we are not going to let the government take over. This is not a country in which we give up individualism. But limited government is not necessarily a selling point on every main street in America. Limited government is actually not practical, it's not realistic, and neither is an outside congressperson that doesn't know how to work with the Washington politics. A Gallup poll taken last fall found that Americans are just as likely to favor a more active government as they are a more limited one when asked about preferred roles for government. More taxes and regulations put Montana families out of work. Spying on our citizens, that's just wrong. We showed the political spot to voters Mike and Shelley Murray. I agree with the overall message. I agree with the overall message. I think it's a little strong. <laughs> that was Rosendale's intention. Every once in a while, somebody has to take a chair and throw it out in the middle of the auditorium to get everybody's attention. The question now, can Rosendale turn that attention into votes and votes into a congressional seat? I'm Christine Frizzell reporting. Spying on our citizens, that's just wrong. I'm Matt Rosendale, and I approve this message because I'm ready to stand tall for freedom and get Washington out of our lives.